and uh, it's time. Our first guest is so beloved by his fans. Many of them camped out here overnight to get good seats to see him. We put them way in the back just to screw them. Uh, his first album is right there, Measure of a Man. So Next month, he kicks off a concert tour starting in Grand Fork, North Dakota. Please welcome America's Idol, Clay Aiken. Yeah. seen this kind of enthusiasm for a guest since Ben Stein was here on Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> they <really haven't. laughs> They're great. But thank you for being here. Yeah, they, well, they do love you. That's for sure. Now, this is uh, your second time on the show. Thank right. you for being here again. The first time you're on with Britney Spears. Right. And were you guys engaged at the time? <laughs> no, I think she was, no, she was, uh, <laughs> she was, uh, I think Dayton, I don't know. She was I single. I don't know, that flustered me for some reason. Yeah. She was interested in DMX that night. He was on the same night. So oh, is that right? And now he's Something's in going jail. On backstage and yeah, yeah, he's in jail now. Did you hear about that? Yes. Yeah. 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 They're both trying to make headlines. Be careful not to impersonate a federal agent. That's if I can give you any advice. Now, I, I make fun of you from time to time on I the show. It's all in a it's all in a very lighthearted spirit. You know that you wouldn't be back if it wasn't for that. And um We talked earlier today where I I want to as make as sure everything was okay. And yeah, we actually, we, uh, I think we had a nice talk actually. And we talked about the stuff because nobody likes to be made fun of, but you know, and of course it's always uncomfortable. But uh, we had a little chat actually, we, uh, we did this earlier today, Clay and I ironing things out. Hey Clay, it's Jimmy. I just want to thank you for coming and you know, sorry about the jokes. What jokes? You mean like when you said that I look like Barry Manilow and Pee Wee Herman had a baby together? Yeah. You know, like when you said the Clay Aiken doll and the Ken doll were dating. Yeah. It's a good doll. Or how about when you said you could use me to light the Olympic torch? No. Actually, I said that about Ryan Seacrest. <laughs> Not so funny now, is it? <laughs> how you like me now, Kimmel? You like getting kicked in the face, Kimmel? I said you like getting kicked in the face? I'm gonna go get some food. You want anything? Invincible. Get it? <laughs> what a bloodthirsty bunch this is. Yeah. People are animals. Make He's, fun of me again, it'll be worse. I know, uh, believe me, it's never going to happen again. <laughs> now you, uh, you, you, do you get this everywhere you go? I mean, <laughs> this is pretty big. Obviously, it's concentrated on a talk show, but... This is the kind of thing where you decide to, this sort of thing goes on, and you decide to, like, become a hermit and never leave your house again. You, well, well, I, don't, I wouldn't say I would become a hermit. It, it makes it a little difficult to go to the grocery store, you know. Thank you. Know, you. Don't you have a servant that you send to the grocery store no, for you? You know, I don't, I don't really want to do that. I'm actually, one of my best friends has come out, um, and he's living with me uh, to kind of help me do some stuff now while I'm doing things like this. And, and, you know, we were talking last night. I don't want to ever get to the point where I don't go to the grocery store myself because then, you know, you become a part of a different, you know, it's a different world, that L.A. world, and I don't want to do that. You is this your childhood pal? Yeah, a friend is, of mine from school. Is it weird now you telling him, go get me potatoes? No, we don't. We make sure. <laughs> we don't do that. I mean, I, I told him, I said, if I'm going to, Go with you until I just can't, you know, I'm gonna go to the grocery store also. Unless I'm tired or something good on TV. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And by the way, make sure they're the fresh strawberries. I don't want any of those, those brews. Yeah. Well, that's good. So, and, and you're, uh, you just got back from vacation, I know. Right. <laughs> it was a vacation. <laughs> it, was, it was kind of a vacation, but I've gotten to this point now where I am the most 
I used to be so good about remembering things and being problem solver, and I'm the most forgetful person on earth now. On the way out of, um, of Philadelphia to go to Ireland, I lost my passport and almost didn't get on the plane. Then we get to Ireland, we're headed from Ireland to London, and uh, my, um, left my keys back at the place we were staying, and back. we couldn't get to them. Uh -huh. And literally we had to ask the lady who was, who was helping us out to put my keys on the next flight to London, and hopefully we'd go back and go, yeah, don't do that. And so, um, <laughs> And then I'm frustrated. Oh, I was frustrated. <laughs> I was frustrated already. I was frustrated already. And we're in the airport. And I ha maybe I maybe I walked in front of this old man. He hit me with his cane. Literally. <laughs> right on. I am still mad about that. I tell you what, if you I see that man, I'm gonna do the same thing. <laughs> he was struck by an old I've man. I've never been hit before. He hit me with his cane. It really? Was horrible. Yes. And then. We finally, the, my keys went to Hong Kong. Really? <laughs> or Dubai or something. And so they didn't, we don't have them. They're gone. <laughs> and then I get back to Atlanta. We land in the U.S. And I'm like, thank you, Jesus, I'm back home. And uh, I left my wallet on the plane. So. Oh, well, that's... And then in the grocery store last night, I left my keys in the grocery yeah. store again. You may, it may be time for you to fire that friend. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? True. <laughs> what did you miss most about the United States while you're over in Ireland? Um, the food is a little rough over there. What do they eat over there? Um, a bunch of nasty animals we don't even have here. Yeah. I don't, I mean, they don't cook it either. If you ask for well done, it's still walking around on the plate. Oh, really? Really? I, yeah, and they eat like the insides. Of, they don't eat the outside as much I don't as the eat inside. It, no. And McDonald's, I mean, McDonald's over there is even really nasty. It wasn't know? the same? It's not the same, really. What was different about McDonald's? It's just not good. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess the endorsement deal for you is out there. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll get you in on my, uh, McDonald's my Wonder Bread good deal. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, Clay Higgins, you're going to sing tonight. Yes. Um, we're going to chat a little more, and we're going to hear more streaming from the. We'll meet some of the fans when we come back. Clay Higgins. <laughs>